Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to the first update of Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2 here on the channel. So, today it is version 24.10 bringing the Spring Breakout 2023. Chicken or the egg? Let your excitement bloom with chickens, eggs and the egg launcher. Heal eggs will restore health and shields, hop eggs will provide low gravity effect and provide health, and golden eggs will grant bars. As you can see we've got these weird types of chicken, they literally now lay eggs. So we're going to watch the video and then I will get into talking about it and obviously I'm also going to mention the week 3 quests in this video just to help you guys out a little bit. So, there you go, you see you right there, the chickens laying their eggs and um, this is a very intense video for a little spring event. So we do also have spring breakout quests, spring into action and complete the spring breakout quest by April 11th to earn the bloom back sack back bling, that's hard to say. The Nana Bloom Hammer Pickaxe and the Fresh Flyer Glider. So, nice and Eastery. And we also have some new reality augments. So, in this update, parts of the island are getting a makeover as things warm up from cherry blossoms to spring chickens. Dig into details below of Spring Breakout 2023. So, just as the island is full of life, decorate your locker with colourful rewards. Um, as I've just said as well, if if you complete the rewards, uh, the quests, you get the rewards. Um, as well, there'll be like a daily quest. So most of them will give you XP, but some of them will give you a special locker item. So day one quest reward is the Bloom Back Sack Back Bling. Day seven, the Shell Smash Spray. Day nine, the Works Loading Screen. And day 12, a Spring Breakout Banner Icon. Um, there are more rewards too, if you complete 12 you get the Nana Bloom Hammer Pickaxe and if you complete 22 you get the Fresh Flyer Glider. We've just talked about the eggs so I'm not going to go over those again. The Egg Launcher is also back, you can find it in ground, loot, chests, supply drops, all for sale from certain characters. You can also get one from the new Springtime Blowout Reality Augment which is only here for the two weeks. Alongside that we also have four more reality augments that are here for the whole season. Rail Warrior, regenerate health and partial sh shield on grind rails or zip lines except while in the storm. Go for Broke, gives you a charged shotgun and a flint lock pistol. Aquatic Warrior, move faster and regenerate health and partial sh shield while swimming except while in the storm. And Game Time, which grants the pizza party and some chug splashes. And finally, we have some new specialist characters, eight specialist characters dropped on the island and ready for hire. There are four different types of specialists, each with a different role to play. Scouts pick off foes from a far with sniper and can ping nearby chests and enemies. Heavy specialists have an explosive inventory and they specialise in making things go boom. Supply specialists drop ammo and mats for you to pick up. And medical specialists uh, heal you with chug splashes to restore your health and shield. Speaking of though, the characters collection page in game has now gotten a little bit easier for you. Instead of collections tab, it's now just characters, and it actually will show you a map of where all the characters are and what they can do. So that will be useful for you. As well as that, really quickly, we're going to go and look at the bonus rewards. We have the new styles, the super level styles, past level 125 to towards 200. We have Kinetic Rush, which is sort of this blue and purple vibe, which is quite nice. Um, the next page, 5, is Neon Citrus, which is sort of a green and blue. I quite like how they're almost sort of an electronic style. And then the final page is sort of black and gold, which is the Mega Wave. So those are really quite cool. Um, so let's have a look at the quests. The quests tab has been updated. You'll notice a new UI. So when you go into it, we'll see Spring Breakout quests. You've got two weeks to do these. Um, as I say, you've got some challenges that will just happen anyway, so stage 1, gather laid eggs, stage 1, spend bars, and stage 1, survive storm phases, so surviving storm phases, spending bars are really easy too. I'll show you guys how to gather laid eggs if we can find any. Then visit Cherry Blossom Tree Displays, they're in some of the older locations, so you can go and check those out. And then for the week 3 quests, which I'll also talk about in this video, uh, accept a bounty at the different circle... Uh, Dueling Circle Bounty Board locations, those are marked on the map for you. Hit a speed of 86 on a road bike isn't too hard, recover a combat cache, those are the little boxes that come down throughout the games. 
hire a scout heavy supply and medical, uh, medic specialist, it does mark those on the map, so those are just the new characters that you can hire. And then finally, claim the capture point on the floating loot island is kind of difficult to do. So, without further ado, me and Brad are going to jump straight into a game. Right. So we'll see you back on the battle bus. So guys, we're back on the battle bus. As you guys can see, we have ping over. It's a little bit of a random location. But... This should be where we can find one of those new characters that we can hire. So, I mean, we're going to go and check that out here in the uh, video. And then we're probably going to make our way down into Slappy Shores where there should be one of the new Cherry Blossom tree displays to go and visit. So, that'll be nice to go and check out. <laughs> Awkward silence indeed. I'm just curious as to what these new characters are like. Oh wow, there actually is like an entire character. Oh my god, there is just a character map now, that is actually sick. So when you pull up like the map and stuff, there's like an entire characters tab now. Triage Trooper. Huh. Bro, he chug splashed us. Yo! I like these guys. <laughs> yeah, I think... Yeah, let's go to Slappy Shores because there's a tr there's a cherry blossom tree there. Or we could go to Brutal Bastion. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, let's just run there though, because we could go by this little beach because there's loot here. I miss the dirt bikes, you know. And the only reason why I miss the dirt bikes compared to the road bikes is because dirt bikes aren't very good off road. Uh, the road, road bikes aren't very good off road. I know, I knew what I meant. Everyone knew. Everyone watching this video knew what I meant. You all know what I meant. You all knew what I meant. I just got it very close to the camera. Oh my god! Ah! You scared the majors or something. these new NPCs. Damn! That was evil. That was actually like evil. Didn't even give that guy a chance to exist. That is true. Alright. Slappity shores. There should be a cherry blossom tree display. Oh, I think I can see it. I can see like pink leaves, like pink petals, like. Oh, well, I would assume that is what we're looking for. That is a cherry blossom tree after all. I also want to clarify for the record, guys, I will not be doing daily videos for Spring Breakout uh, quests unless it is a tough quest. The main reason for that is because A, I have plans over Easter, and B, I have plans over my Easter. And I found some one! Yay! The medic healed me. I actually love these medic guys. Hey Brad. A shield pot may be useful for you.
trying to work out what 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 we should do next. <laughs> There's so much to do. We could head down to one of the, we could head down to a dueling ring. Oh no, you just have to visit it. Oh, he did not like that. He did not like you sniping him then, did he? Is my guy just is my guy shield bubbling just to try and escape? Coward. You're Dr. Victor Von Doom, you shouldn't be a coward. Ooh. Legendary tactical pistol, huh? I'm heading over to a dueling ring, yeah. They're the little Japanese dueling rings in the light like, new area. Oh, have you, have you not? Okay. Cedar Circle. And you've got to you've got to accept a, a bounty at two different ones of these as well. Is the annoying thing. Oh, you've got a rogue bike. You've got to hit a speed of eighty six on that. You can boost, as far as I know. You, you probably need to boost. I'm gonna run towards you so you can pick me up, and then we can drive to like another cherry blossom tree display. Right, I'm coming down to you, I'm coming down to you. D yeah, don't worry, I'm coming down to you. Oh god. And then, do you want to drive us to Brutal Bastion, maybe? Go visit the cherry. Yeah, um... Wait, what speed are we going? Because I also need to do the 86. There we go. Ah, good to know that I don't need to be the one driving. That is quite, quite good to know, yeah. The only issue is, is where are you going to go here? Ah, you're going to go up here. Oh, wait! Wait, eggs! There's eggs! There's eggs! This chicken has laid eggs! Oh, but we can't. I can't consume them because I, I need to take damage. Bro, the way these chickens lay eggs is actually quite funny. Fortnite chickens lay eggs now. <laughs> Look, what has Fortnite become? Farming Simulator um, Unreal, Ed Unreal Engine Edition. Whoa. These eggs are cool. So. I had a hot frog egg. So for those of you watching. That's how you 
get laid eggs, I guess. You've just got to find a good chicken. Uh, hope it lays you some eggs and eat. Ah, it was ice. There are more eggs. These just come like a week early. Can't lie, I'm gonna ditch the bike at this point. Okay, the tree's in the sort of like centre courtyard bit. It's right here. You just need you just need to visit it, so you actually need to like basically tap the tree. I love how there's just random chickens like walking around laying eggs. Don't com don't complain. <laughs> from like week two. I'm heading towards the uh, combat cache because we do have a quest this week to recover one of those. So I'm kind of, I kind of want to show on the uh, video. For those of you that don't know, this is what the combat caches are. They're the little pods that you have to stand next to to crack them open. Uh, if you take too long to get to it though, it goes from blue to purple to, uh, no, from legendary to purple to blue. But these are them and you just rip off the Nice and simple quest to do. And then we do have the loot island spawning in Brad, so I don't know if you want to try and capture that in a second as well. And then after that I think we've pretty much shown every single quest and how to do them. Which is always useful. Hmm? No, I don't think so, but I'm I'm dead anyway. No, Brad, carry on to the island. Carry on to the island. Run for the island. Run. You can show off the flag on which capture point it is that they need to capture for the quest. You can you can model. <laughs> you can model it. Yeah, there is only the one up here. That's why this is going to be a hard quest, because... Uh, but, but have you noticed that this is the double XP quest? It's a 24,000 mob. Yeah, should be. <laughs> oh, no. So that is the flag you need to capture, guys, down there. However, I somehow get the feeling that we will not be capturing it this game. And to be honest, Brad, if you survive this, then fair play. So guys, we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back to lobby. But as we go back to lobby, I just want to state, I've kind of shown you guys pretty much every quest. Hopefully, with that, you guys can work out how to do your week three quests and your the first of your spring breakout quests. But with that all in mind, guys, thanks for watching the video. I hope you find it informative, enjoyable, and fun to watch. And I'll see you all in the next one.